Good morning, sir, and welcome to another day of the video diary. And it's the day before my first ever university exam, and it's the maths one, and it's the one I'm looking forward to the least. Yes, and I'm just going over revision. I've been revising since 8 o'clock, it's now 1 o'clock. Um, and I'm just terrified. I keep finding things that I still can't do. And it's not a case of not being able to do it, it's a case of not being able to unlock it. That's what I hate about maths exams. It's if you don't see the predicate, if you don't see this certain thing and this certain way of doing it, then you may as well just kiss the question goodbye. Even if you know exactly what to do and you know in your head that you can get to the answer eventually, then it means nothing. And I'm terrified of it. And I'm gonna go cry to help cry for help now. Andy, the person I've been helping with with programming and stuff, um, every now and again, in a way, has off said, if you need some help, then then come come to me, because he did maths last year, so he's pretty confident on the whole maths -y kind of stuff. So I'm gonna go and ask for a bit of help. It's the first two, the first two are okay, they're pretty easy, the first two are. It's the others, the, the other, th well, no, the third one's all right as well. It's the last two, which is beasts and there's five que five questions to choose from or four questions to choose from and three of them you have to do it takes two hours to do three different questions Jesus you need your library card you donut so I woke up this morning at seven by eight o'clock I was dressed and ready to go and I was working on all of this revisiony kind of stuff I went over one of the topics um, from the lecture slides and things then did some questions on it uh, did the same with another one, did the same on the other one. Getting stuck in different places, I then just tried to do different questions on it. Just to see how I can, like, maximise what's going on. I swear I never leave this flat without forgetting something. <coughs> well, change of plan. Basically what happened was I came back to the flat and I just sat down and did some maths. I'd gotten to the point where I was literally just scrolling up and down the list. I'm dropping things. Where I was just scrolling up and down the question mark paper and going, I can't answer that, 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 can't answer that. And that's a terrible mindset to get yourself into. So I got myself out of it as soon as possible, just came in, just sat down, and just kind of did it, like soldered on, muscled on. I got the last two questions done. So I've got two complete questions completed on the paper. You've got to do three. Um, the other two were hard. But the other two are on topics where it's kind of dependent on what the question is as opposed to being able to do it. It's not a case of not knowing how to do it, it's a case of being able to see your opportunity to prove that you can do it because you've got to like prove, you've got to like twist stuff into a position where you can then apply the things that you know and it's just seeing how to open it. Um, obviously tomorrow I will try and decide which one's best and then spend a lot of time on it because I've got two hours to complete three questions and those two questions only took an hour so that's an extra hour on top. And exam pace is obviously a hell of a lot quicker than normal pace sat here listening to music. So, um, it's basically, I'm not worried. I'm in the hands of the god now. It's not fudge all I can do about it now, so what's the point of worrying about it, you know what I mean? Um, so after that I cooked myself some dindins. Um, chicken and chips, basically. <laughs> Lol. Um, came into here, got dressed, went to work. Um, work was awesome. I showed up yesterday just like a load of errors that everyone was doing. Like a massive mistake everyone was doing wrong except me. And it showed up on the records today when we lost 600 pounds worth of stock because I, because I zeroed it out of the inventory because I was doing what I was supposed to be doing. And then, oh man, yes. <laughs> just, I love showing people. I love showing people who are idiots, who people think are idiot. When people think idiots are clever, I love showing them just how idiotic idiots are. So, so none of them watched this lot. So that was good, lol. Um, else, that's it really. Walking down, talking to lovely about plans about the Valentine's thing, when we're going, when I'm going to go to Valentine's thing. You know, when I go to Lovely's at the 1st of February to celebrate my birthday and Valentine's, how we're gonna swap presents and things. I can collect my present as of now. I'm gonna get it on Thursday. Um, but I can get the present and stuff, but I'm gonna film it but I'm not going to show you it, it's not a daily vlog kind of video, I just want to keep it for safekeeping. Also, I might daily vlog it as well, but I'm definitely going to use the big camera and set up a microphone and stuff, because it's a freaking good present, man. Balls to it, I'll daily vlog a little bit of as well, why not? Um, uh, so yeah, we talked about that, we talked about trains and things and that and stuff and things. And we basically just walked down the entire way. Lovely has finished her exams today, she only had one exam and she finished it today. It went alright for her, so it's going to go alright for me. So I'm now back, I'm in my GB jams, um, and I'm going to lie here, 
until I fall asleep watching YouTube videos. I'm gonna curl up and like stick my little head out like a little baby. And then tomorrow the plan is get up early, seven o'clock, get nice and relaxed, get into the mindset of an exam. Leave here for nine o'clock, so I get there at nine, which is about five to. Um, sit the exam, pone it, come back, relax for a little bit, then jump into revision for my next exam, which is the day after. And then we get a week off. So Thursday is gonna be the single most relaxed day of my entire life. It's gonna be great. I'm gonna have a massive lion. I'm not gonna set any alarms. Um, I'm gonna go pick up Lovely's present, and oh, it's gonna be great. So yeah, that's my plans, lol. <laughs> it's been a fun day today, so fun. So yeah, I'm gonna catch you later. Thank you for watching. And I was about to say I wish you a Merry Christmas, I don't know why. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. So uh, wish me luck, and I'll catch you later.